In this assessment, we're asked to identify the species that gets reduced in this somewhat complicated oxidation reaction. And so we know that in any time an oxidation occurs, in this case, oxidizing the carbon here to give the carbonyl, so the oxidation step occurs at this point, every oxidation must be accompanied by a reduction. And so this one, we can identify that species by noticing the sulfur. Sulfur here has one lone pair of electrons, three bonds and a positive charge. But when we look at it in the product, that sulfur now has two pairs of electrons and only two bonds. And so it's that sulfur species that gets reduced during the oxidation step of this overall oxidation reaction.